Hello friends and welcome back to Garden Time with Kate. Today it's a Thoughtful Tuesday. I thought how better to spend a Thoughtful Tuesday than using mirrors to change our perspective on things. The first thing that I reckon you can do with mirrors is if you just put one flat on the floor and you look above it, you can see yourself with all of the blue sky or all of the clouds above you. It looks a bit different. This is what I must look like from a bug's perspective. Ooh. Or you could do the opposite. This is what I must look like from a bird's perspective. Another way that you can change perspective using a mirror is by getting different shaped mirroring objects like a spoon. What happens if you look at your reflection in a spoon? Does it do anything funny? And what about the back of the spoon? Does that do anything funny? Can you find something which is curved? I've just got a coffee pot here. Ooh, what does that do to your reflection? One thing that I also really love to do with mirrors, if you use a sturdy block or something to prop one up like this, and then you hold this one up like this, then, oh, it makes infinite mirrors. How many times can you see yourself? Wow. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Wow, that's so cool. Endless mirrors. Another thing that you can do with mirrors is you can put some objects on top of them. Here I've got a pine cone. I'm going to put it on top of my mirror here. And now I can look at the pine cone from lots of different ways all at the same time. You can do the same with a shell. Or you could do the same with something else that you find in the garden. Or even your favourite toy. Something that I also really love to do is I love to do some drawing on mirrors. Now here I've got some whiteboard markers, some that rub off. Can you see what that says? It's a number three. Can you see what this says? It's a cup for Kate. I really love practicing letters on a mirror because you can watch yourself whilst you're doing some writing or some drawing. Can you see? It's a sheep! <laughs> Another thing that can be really fun is if you add just a few drops of water to your mirror. You could even add some drops of colour into the water and see how that changes it too. You can use your finger and draw some things with water on the mirror. You can drip water on there. Watch how it splashes. All whilst looking at yourself doing it is great. On our Thoughtful Tuesday today, we've used mirrors to change our perspective, change how we see things. We've also explored some natural objects on our mirrors, as well as doing some drawing and splashing some water onto our mirrors. I've had a great time looking at things from a different point of view. Have you? We'll be back tomorrow for a Wildlife Wednesday and we'll see you then.